Uh, Tom, you're on WABC with Lynn. Hi, Lynn. Uh, this group, who's that group, Simotap? Yeah, it's like really an ad for that new Broadway show, you know. Oh. You know that bring in the noise, bring in the funk. It says C-Mo-Tap. But what's this? It's an ad for tap dancing. Oh, wh what is this? Never mind. It's, it's, it stands for, you didn't get it. I'm being no, no, funny. I know, it's a joke. I, I... It stands for the Committee to Eliminate Media Offensive to African People. So what they're looking to do basically is sanitize radio. Well, yes, they want Phil Boyce fired. Right. They want Curtis, Lionel, Ed, and Rush There goes fired. the station. I can say, yeah, well, you know who will be on? It'll be all Lynn, Adrian, Dr. Wally, Religion on the Line, and Dick. Now, we all love Dr. Dick. Dr. Oh, yeah, her too. <laughs> we all love Dick. You know... But, oh, and Mario. Oh, even more Mario. Well, what, what this really is going to end up doing ultimately, if this really starts getting out of hand, this could work against those same people to something they're going to like. I well, mean, I don't... Too far to the left or too far to the right with this stuff. Well, I mean, who do they think they are? You know, I mean, it's like they come in. Why don't they, you know, it's like if they walk into Macy's and say, all right, fire that clerk and that clerk and that who are they well it's gonna get too out of hand if this stuff keeps going on well i think they're a little taken with themselves well if it works though and every time you put a little pressure on these people in upper management and they're gonna fold well no they're gonna find them too phil boyce is on the list so then so then where does this leave talk radio well there it is me Dr. Wally, Dick. I mean, Lynn, I don't agree with you on a lot of stuff, but I'll tell you the truth. I do enjoy listening to you. Thank you. And I, I, I like to hear what the other side has to say, and I'm open-minded enough to know that if maybe you could persuade me, I, I will change my mind from time to time. Nothing I believe is etched in stone. But and if the they're not going to give us... And the talk radio is that you can be iconoclastic, is that you can make... You know, you can smart also, comments. You can also interact like I am and call up and agree or disagree. But if, if they're going to keep chipping away, it's just... Well, I don't think event. anybody's going to listen to them. And I'll tell you something. I have heard people from CMOTAP interviewed, and they're morons. They really are. You know, I mean, Al Sharpton, you can say, I like him, he's very smart, but he's misguided in this. I like Jesse Jackson. But these CMOTAP people, they're imbeciles. They really are. You have to hear them interviewed. But these people are the same ones that say we need diversity all the time. Then when they get diversity of idea, oh, that becomes dangerous. Well, I think what they want is a black liberal talk show host. That's what I think. Well... Lynn. <laughs> yes, yeah, somebody's so calling you. Bye. Call waiting. Okay, nice. call waiting is censorship. Hi, Ed. Hi, uh, Lynn. There's two things I'd like to say. First of all, I have to disagree with you about the Bernie situation. Uh, if, if he would have stood by, he could have been knifed and killed by these criminals. If they had pulled a knife, he could have shot yeah, but them. But even with the, uh, the screwdriver, he could have got hurt. They never pulled the screwdriver. Right. Did you read the Daily, see the Daily News today with Jesse Jackson, Al Sharpton in, in, in it? I was just talking about that. Yeah, well... What'd you do, only look at the picture? No, well, I think it's a shame what is going on here. And the only way that th this whole situation is going to stop, if we ship them back to Africa where they came oh, from... Oh, please ship you back to wherever you came from under that rock ed hi evelyn hi how are you okay how are you doing oh good hello i want to ask you a question yes you were saying something before that really bothered me 